this episode, we stay one night at Skuguza Rest Camp, where we had an amazing leopard on a guided night drive, a rest sighting of silver antelope, male lion, and many other species. It's a long queue, eh? It's good morning from Satara. Uh, we are about six o'clock exactly. We are leaving Satara. So the plan now is to get to Skukuza around nine somewhere there so that we can get camp. We will most likely drive on the tar road and then we drive on the tar road until we reach Skukuza and yeah, we'll check the pens as well, uh, Leo pen and yeah, move on we also hear the lion, uh, uh, a leopard right close to, sounded like it's close to the, the Sadar rest camp gate it was rasping, sowing but yeah, I'm not gonna be following up on that. It's like maybe an hour ago or so. Yeah, look at the mist here. Beautiful. Wow. We haven't seen any animal yet and we are arriving here at 180 bridge or what river from Saraf. We are here to Nkaya Pen. So just wanna scan around and see what's in here. It's a greenwood or pool making noise, I think. There's nothing much happening here. Lions yesterday. Seems like the lions have moved on and the vultures are having a feast. Doesn't look like hyenas were here, otherwise, everything would have been gone.
this is Mwapsi Tsotso River. We just passed Okwani. There is nothing much there. We haven't seen much game since we passed Maziti. Along the way today, actually, it's been quite a lot of giraffes along the way, a few elephants and a fish, and a fish eagle, a lot of impalas around and next to Chokwan. So now we're going to go straight here because we're heading to Skukuza and then we're going to loop into Leopen and see what is around there and how is the water level so this goes to lower savi it's h10 but we are continuing on h12 After Kruger tables, we came across two several uh, antelopes bulls. Yeah, this is probably the best sighting so far after seeing Casper yesterday. I mean, not every single day you'll get to get one of these guys and take a few photos. It's actually my first time seeing them here in Kruger National Park for me. And yeah, wow, wow, what a privilege this is to be able to to have these guys. We haven't seen any predators today, but wow, um, this is great.
So, we're on our way to Skukuza. We just came across a male lion sitting down here. It's far, very far. No clear picture can be taken here. This guy is very far. It doesn't look like they're secure. There's one vulture. Uh, nothing much. There's a lot of cars. I think we're going to move out now and give other guys a chance. So we're just quickly going out so it's like more like midday. Just going out for a quick drive like for an hour or one hour 30 minutes. Just going to like panic and see how things look there. So there's a change of plans. We're going to be here for tonight only. And then Monday to Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday we're going to be at Adaba. So we just wanna see how the panic looks. Since tomorrow won't get a time to go outside and then maybe drive on S S65 and then come back on the road and relax for an hour so that yeah we can go out again for, for our sunset game drive. We we'll also book night drive here tonight so that we can maximize our day since we'll be leaving. But this will probably be the last uh, night drive we'll book on this trip because yeah, the rest will be at Satara. We want to relax a bit there. Then yeah, the sunset drive we're not sure where to go, but we'll see when we come back what we see along the way as well. So we just arrived just outside. Look what we have. We have female yellows.
So we're still inside the walkway of Lake Panic. There are two buffaloes there, and we saw two, three of them, yeah. And then there's a couple of female nyalas and male nyalas, which one were very close. Yeah, a, these are Dhaka boys, not Dhaka, Dhaka boys. It's actually our first sighting of, of um, buffaloes for today. So here, we are just driving on S30. We are doing our afternoon camp drive. So yeah, the plan is to turn around there, our survey, and head back on the Taros to our to Skukuza and then to our night drive there. So yeah, it'll be interesting to see what we come across on the estate. Woodpecker in Sanga, we call this one Gogosani. This has to be the most relaxed warthog I have seen. Very close to us. She's very close to us. Next month probably will be giving birth. That stomach. Next month or the next coming two months. Apparently there's a leopard there, you can see it's lying flat. So yeah, it's about time to close, so we're gonna bounce now.
McDonald's. It's fucking hot. So right now, to the insurgents, such like a mice, snake, then soon shall shed the shining eye of their eyes on the people. That is what that Jesus is saying. Okay. All right. Mm. It'll go, guys. Yep. yep. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. Here are some of the images I took on this day. Enjoy.
Thanks for watching. Please join us on the next episode as we camp three nights at Satara. And if you like the content I post here, please help me grow the channel by hitting the subscribe button, like and share the video.